Hello friends, Running Kimono here. So something weird happened over at the Dollar General today where a lot of older items pennied out. Um, Christie's Connections posted a couple videos about this. So I had to get myself to a store. I went to a non-updated store, guys. And a lot of this older stuff found in the clearance section, a penny. Uh, my understanding is that newer updated stores, it hasn't yet to penny, but at older stores, it is in fact pennying. You got to go in the clearance section, really root around. And um, I think I found about 90. Um, it's really a bad snowstorm here, so I could only do a little bit. Um, and I, I suspect that not a lot of shoppers will be out uh, because it, the roads are pretty awful. But like some of this stuff, like even this Duracell fast charging cord, like it's some weird stuff. Pliers, like it's not a normal penny list. Uh, it's just a lot of clearance stuff that's been around for a very long time. I do the clearance videos for uh, whenever they have a clearance event. So a lot of this stuff looks familiar and it finally pennied out, which is crazy. So at your Dollar General store, if you have an older store that like if you have a brand new store they probably don't have these items but a store that's probably like at least three four years old in the clearance section if they have a lot of stuff it's like older than the store it's got a good amount of dust I would definitely open up the Dollar General app and scan and if it's showing for um you know a penny uh I would definitely you know <laughs> grab it all make a deal happen and um I went to an older store um and I used self-checkout and everything rang up for a cent. Uh, from last week where I was getting a lot of the Halloween stuff, um, I wouldn't go more than 100 at self-checkout because it seems to choke the machine. But it is in fact working and you really have to put a bit of work into this, guys, where you are scanning everything. So you will be at the Dollar General for a little bit. Um, so if you can get out there tonight, I, I would, because especially if you know, oh, the clearance section has a good amount of stuff. Um, and it's not just like soap and it's also a lot of like cake baking things, um, crafty stuff, like a lot. It's a very... Um, versatile list um, and it, and the older your store is and if people really don't coop on there you're really gonna hit um, hit a big one um, and to find 90 this afternoon I was absolutely shocked because I am NOT a good penny shopper and I always say that and then I'm lying all the time what we're gonna do guys is just go through these really quickly and I'm gonna show you what I got this is a Duracell um, fast charging cord I guess for the car it is a very tiny UPC if you see anything that looks similar you know scan it um, but yeah there was that and there was a different cord as well and I just found them hung up um, in the clearance section and I only went to one store again because the snow here is just like booming safeguard the hand refill only the one with the pump is still six dollars and fifty cents so it's a very very weird penny list um, and here is the UPC I've uh, just loving, I think I got 11 of these soaps. I cleared them out. We also have this guy, Life Boy, which is a smaller hand soap with a pump. Penny, I mean, it's just fantastic. So if you remember um, during the pandemic, all this stuff started appearing at the Dollar General. So this is like almost three years, or it is three years old. Um, so yeah, there we are clearing all of it out. The um, Suave Hand Sanitizer Spray, this was also a penny. Now with this one, um, there were other types of hand sanitizer. It was all like, you know, regular clearance price. So you really have to put the work in to scan everything. If you have no idea how to scan stuff with the Dollar General app, I'll link a video at the very end called Game Changer and it shows you how to do it. We have the Studio Selection, which is the Dollar General brand. Um, it's a body wash. It looks a lot like a vino. Um, but this is all the stuff that I was finding that was a penny. Um, and I really hit the big one at this one store. Swiffer XL Heavy Duty 10 count. We were getting these for free at various clearance events. But like a penny. I mean, that's just a crazy price point for this. So I was really delighted. And then a lot of air fresheners for your car. Scan everything. This is what I had luck with. These refresh ones. And uh, the ones that are the little trees rang up, you know, regular price. So it's just a very confusing thing. But once you start hitting a roll and hitting your stride, you might find like the entire store and be like, oh my gosh. Um, but these two cents, uh, the pink and the uh, purple one, um, I got one, I got a bunch of each. And then uh, we have this little cooling cloth and a lot of this fitness stuff, some of it was ringing up um, penny and then the other full price. So it was just really weird. Pumpkin's meowing in the background. Uh, he misses his dad, if you hear that. Um, 
Also, these pliers, which totally, I was like, what? Because I just started scanning everything. So I was in the store for like an hour plus doing this. A pair of pliers for a cent. I mean, that is an unheard of price. So it's just very random things. And this is interesting. It's some sort of like cupcake scented tape. And just for fun, I scanned it and it was a penny. So I was like, okay, I'll take it. And check this out. Cute little cupcake there on the side. So I might have to keep that one for myself because it's so adorable. Now, if you are into uh, decorating cakes, um, this little uh, fondant smoother like original price is two fifty, and for a penny, like this company, it's called Baked with Love. If you find anything with that, uh, definitely scan it with the Dollar General app. And you might have to park yourself right at the front, depending how their Wi-Fi or if you don't have a signal in the store. This is also called a fondant rolling pin. I am not into baking cakes, but I do know some people that uh, could definitely use this. A nine incher and a penny, which is a terrific price point. And this is by the company Art Skills. So sometimes with patterns at the Dollar General, if uh, one item by a certain company is ringing up a certain price point, for the penny, you know that, oh, let me scan everything. And it might be tedious, but it's part of the game. Here's another example. This is called Pro Something or Other. And that little um, um, ice pack that you put uh, water in to cool off, uh, this is the same company. It's called Pro Strength. So these little, um, you know, you put your smoothie stuff in there and shake it, a uh, penny. I mean, that's just an unheard of price point. And the thing with penny shopping, don't mention it to the employees. Do not destroy the clearance section. Keep it neat and tidy. And uh, I used self-checkout because I don't even want to deal with employees <laughs> when I'm doing my penny shopping. Um, and then this is a little spoon, like anything that's been in the clearance section for a really long time. And you're like, yeah, I've seen that there a really long time. Definitely, um, you know, scan it. It's worth it. Now, uh, some stuff for the kiddos, 136 mini stickers, penny. I mean, and this is cute. So you know, every kid at the party will get a thing of stickers. I mean, just adorable stuff. And um, also I found these larger um, like party kits. So there's a 30 count party favor for three bucks. That's some value, but for a cent, I mean, you just can't beat that price point. And this is more focused towards uh, girls. And I have a lot of nieces, so definitely we'll be including that, um, you know, super cute stuff. And here is the UPC. Because it's such a vast list, guys, and it's just all over the place from pliers to party supplies to like a fondant rolling pin, I would definitely get out as soon as possible. Um, I think that uh, other like-minded penny shoppers, when they can get out and make these deals happen, they certainly will. Okay, that's it for this video. Get out to Dollar General and have a lot of fun. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.